Hey, we're back after a weekend of um, quote unquote technical difficulties with YouTube, and we have to be reborn as King Neo the Second. So we're back with another update for March 16, 2020, Monday. Um, market's crashing again as usual, but we may have some good news. So yeah, uh, starts off with the numbers. US is not doing well. Uh, Trump is doing, pulling all guns on the economic side and border closing. Same with Trudeau up here in Canada. Just announced our border closing here as well. But um, yeah, the new numbers are still stacking up. We have new deaths in the hundreds and cases in the thousands in Europe where it's getting hit hard. So yeah, US is close to a thousand cases as well. Um, yeah, just look at North America, Europe, Asia. This, I don't see the end of the tunnel, but perhaps there is hope. Um, this is from windy.com just now. Uh, measuring the pollution levels and after the biggest drop in history in February we see an uptick in pollutions from the industrial sectors again possibly so we'll see if factory workers are actually returning to work staying alive and we have to watch this for a few weeks um, if it's sustains maybe we can see the end of the tunnel and of course with a little bit of uh, good news the Chinese Communist Party propaganda arm CCTV and CGTN in uh, the West is definitely pushing their agenda quite hard and by now you've probably seen these guys in Wuhan apparently doctors removing their mask in celebrations of uh, closing down their temporary concentration camp or uh, what they call hospitals. Um, you would think it's a little bit too early to celebrate but um, hey it's China. So with the way UK is handling this they are expecting this just to keep boiling until 2021 could be longer but uh, when they're saying 7.9 million people hospitalized they're not gonna have enough beds to take care of these people so when they say hospitalized I will call them dead so hopefully it doesn't have to come to that but let's see how people behave this has a lot to do with our own behavior as much as how the um, policy makers do their thing. The power is in your hands. So if you're in France, you would be in a forced lockdown and they are sending 100,000 police officers to enforce this. So you are staying inside according to the orders, otherwise you're getting guns to your face. So play by the rules and hopefully you have been preparing like we've been telling you to and playing the market because after another promise 500 billion after like the trillions that they have Spent already, Dow is down another 3,000 points. There's no stopping this, I'm telling you. They are not fixing the core problems of dead people, dead workers, dead workforce. This trend is not going to reverse. Either they don't get this or they want this to keep happening on some kind of population control. So yeah, we mentioned this already. So the administration have provided free testing for all in the state. So that's pretty good. And we still need to have 
free hospital stays profile for the most vulnerable profile for the quarantine suspend their expenses otherwise we will have a totally wrecked economy and hey what's gonna happen is gonna happen right so yeah uh, hopefully you are commenting subscribing to our new channel because we had to redo our channel and be reborn as King Leo the second like and share and what do you think is gonna happen so just a quick reminder you would definitely want to wear a mask if you're outside definitely a good time to have your guns and ammo in order there has been a big surge in gun sales in the states have your fuel gas diesel wood chips whatever you have water supplies will be important no one's mentioned this yet and food supplies all right thanks for listening and uh, we'll see you tomorrow